Hey, YouTubers, I want to talk about Arduino. Arduino has been kind of a black box for me, but really all it is is, if, you, if you're familiar, you know this, it's a mini computer, basically. Um, this one has a 3D printed housing. Uh, my daughter got this for me for Christmas, and it had a, a sign, a digital sign attached to it that was mounted to a little post. Um, she got it in the UK, so it was really meant for train passenger stations. So I'm going to convert it into a uh, highway sign, but I want to talk a little bit about Arduino because I'm learning about it for the first time. Um, this is an Arduino Nano, so it's basically, if you take this 3D printed base off of it, it's just a, a chip, a small chip. And, you know, you can program tasks and it'll, it'll do things, uh, anything from, uh, you know, automatically open turnouts with sensors to running signs like this. Um, so I just plug it into my USB and I've, I've learned how to program it. The, the code is, they call it sketch, but it's really code. Um, and I think it, I think it's basically C++ if you're C or C++ if you're into coding. Um, so my daughter is a software engineer, so she's helped me out with this a lot. And I, I was able to figure out, and you can use AI to help you write the code pretty easily. Um, but basically what it's, what it's doing here, um, is it's, it's, it's a set of code that's telling it to rotate, uh, lines of text one over the other construction ahead, expect delays, next exit 29 and so on. Don't speed, click it or take it. So I wanted to represent what you'd see in Connecticut, uh, on a digital highway sign. And that's what you see there is a the code. So this, this is their software app. Um, I think it's called ID, IDE, maybe. Uh, yeah, IDE, Arduino RDE. So I downloaded that and uh, got that sketch together and uploaded it onto the Arduino. And then the Arduino plugs into a screen. Now there's different color screens. This The one that it came with was blue, and I showed that in a prior video. I ordered two that are white, so I might use those in other applications. And then... This one's yellow to represent highway signage. So it was a little harder to get, but they're not expensive. It was like four bucks and then four bucks shipping. And the the person I got it from or the entity I got it from was on eBay, but um, they've been great to work with and good prices. So this is not, a, I'm not being paid to promote this. I just thought that they were very helpful. So um, look them up on eBay store for any, any kind of electronic parts, um, and Arduino, which is great for model routing. So anyway, let's talk about the sign. The sign itself here is what I have programmed into it. Um, this is typically what you'd see overhead on a highway sign. Construction ahead, expect delays. Next exit 29, Route 14A, Plainfield. That's off I-395 in Connecticut. Don't speed, click it or ticket. And then it'll just continue to rotate that on the layout. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna put that into this uh, scratch, scratch built housing so very similar to what you see overhead when you're on the highway it's got a gantry on the back and there's a little platform in the front so they can fix it if they need to so that that arduino display well it's not actually an arduino display it's an oled display 0.91 inches i think is the uh, spec on it and that just pops right in this and, and it sits flush against the housing there and then over top of it, I'll put a little um, acrylic covering. So the only thing you see, there's a clear opening, will be around this. And that'll that'll sit on a post, um, which I make, uh, will make out of brass rod. So a little thicker at the bottom and thinner at the top. And then this, this sign will just be at the top. And I'm going to put it up, up here, uh, right on this overpass. So as you're looking at the layout, it's just another piece of visual interest for the the observer of the layout. Um, it'll it'll be coming up off of here. There'll be a little extension, concrete extension. The post will go up here and then the sign will be here over this lane going that way. So when you're looking at the layout, um, you'll see that highway signage and I'll hide the wires going down through the cement column so you won't see them. So yeah, something different. And I've always wanted to dabble in Arduino. Um, like anything, it's easier once you, you get your hands on it and it's sort of a black box, sort of like DCC was for me before I got into that. So a uh, lot more 
to do with this technology, but uh, let me show you two other things. And hopefully, look, if I could figure out Arduino, you can if you haven't already done it. Um, the other two things I want to show you. Um, I scratch built this ladder. Um, it'll go up the, that post that I showed you. So I'll help you use a brass post, put the sign on it, and then this little ladder like you'd see on a real highway sign. Um, just styrene, uh, styrene rods, very small diameter. Um, it isn't perfect. I sand it up, sand it up and uh, paint it, but I love to scratch build things. And the last bit is this lens that I told you about. So this will sit over that housing so that when you look at it, it actually looks like just a highway sign. So you don't see that board. So yeah, a little different uh, thing to do to just add some more realism to the layout. And uh, I, will give, I will give updates once I get that sign put together and up on the layout. I'll show it to you and talk a little bit more about it. Hope that was interesting and helpful. Have a great week. Cheers.